Today I'm going to show you five ways to tie a lark's head knot, so let's get started. First up is just the basic lark's head knot. Find the center of your cord by folding it in half. The loop in the middle is your center. Place your loop over top and behind your wooden dowel. Then simply pull your tail ends through the loop and secure it tightly. Next I'm going to show you a faster method to tie a lark's set. Find your center loop and fold it over. And then just slide it onto your wooden dowel. If you're a macrame textile artist like myself who has lots of commissions, this is very helpful and saves a lot of time. Next up is the reverse lark's head. Find your center loop just like before, but this time we're going underneath and up. Attaching your rope just like this makes it look like it's a row of double half hitches. Next is the nestled. First we're going to attach just a regular lark's head knot. The reason why we would use this method is because it's an excellent way to add color. So that being said, let's grab our second color, then slide the two tail ends behind. Bring your two tail ends behind and over top of your wooden dowel and through the loop. You can do some pretty cool things with this method. And last but not least, the running lark's head. This one requires a longer piece of cord. Loop your cord over top and around your wooden dowel. Bring it across your short tail end. Then back around your wooden dowel, but this time going from underneath. And then over top and down through your loop. Cinch up your slack and then we're going to run it across the wooden dowel. This is a common way to layer your wall hangings. Alright, so we're going to repeat the same thing again on the other side. Bring your cord up over top and around your wooden dowel. Bring it across your running strand and then we're going to go back up behind our wooden dowel and through the loop. When I start wall hangs like this, I like to tie a half hitch using the short tail ends. That way my running strand doesn't get misshapen. If macrame is your jam and you want to learn more, I hope you consider subscribing. Also here are two more videos I think you'll enjoy. I'll see you over there.